Hello, my dear students. Hope you're doing well. Welcome to Unit 1, Christian Ethics. And now I would like to briefly explain what you're going to learn about in this unit. And before we start, I would like to set le the learning objectives for this unit. So throughout this unit, you will know that God is the creator of all humans and he created us in his own likeness. That's why all the people have equal rights on earth, no matter race or gender. You will also understand the importance of the values that are taught in parables and how they affect our life in a positive way. You will also be able to, to create a poster that shows how modern church helps young Christians overcome moral issues. All right, so the first lesson in this unit talks about the Bible. I know you all know many things about Bible, and I know many of you have read the Bible. Uh, but in this lesson, we are going to focus on the importance of the Bible for Christians. And the Bible is an important source of information about right and wrong. And we believe that the Bible is the most important book ever written, and it comes from God, and as well as containing poems, songs, and stories about history. It also gives rules and advice about the right way to live. So um, we are going to find out what what the Bible teaches about uh, the moral issues and how young people and how it helps the young people to overcome them and we are going to find out what is the role of the of the modern church in it and we are going to inquire into the meaning of sanctity the sanctity of life i know the word sanctity might sound um, new to many of you so we are going to explore what Bible teaches about the human life. Why, why is it so valuable? Why do we believe that it's sacred? Uh, because the Christians often say that they believe in the sanctity of life. When they say this, they mean that they believe that there is something special and holy about life. And for us, human life is different from other kinds of life. Just because in some mysterious way, people share something of the nature of God. And we will talk about the abortion. What does the Bible teach about it? And a few lessons are going to be dedicated to the topic of marriage and divorce. What do you know about marriage? What does Bible teach about marriage? We are going to find out what are the, the responsibilities of the wife and the husband in the family and how can the, the modern church help to save the marriage. Human rights and gender equality, what do you know about them? I know the topic might not sound um, new to you, but we are going to find out what Bible teaches about equality. Are we all equal? What do you think? What is discrimination? And one of the greatest issue on the planet that we have right now is poverty, of course. We are going to find out how does church help the poor and what church organizations do in order to reduce poverty uh, in the world. So now you know what we are going to talk about in Unit 1. I hope you're going to enjoy our journey and I'll see you in class.